Hi there, this is Joanne Rudling from howtospell.co.uk and in this video we're looking at whether to add a plural S or ES to words ending in O. With some words we add S, some we add ES and some we can add both. We're going to look at some rules around this, but before we do, I just want to say that good spellers usually see what looks right and you need to develop this because the rules are a bit um, weird and like all spelling rules, there are loads of exceptions. But we'll look at the rules in a minute. Have a look at these um, words. Can you see which ones look correct? Which ones look strange? Look at these radios, tomatoes, potatoes, pianos, photos, mangoes. Do you know which is correct? Which looks a bit weird? Well, we're going to go over some of the rules, um, but remember, as I just said, like all spelling rules, there are always exceptions. And we'll look at those two. Let's look at a little rule number one. Words ending with a vowel, that's A-E-I-O-U, plus O, so vowel plus O, we always add S. Radio, radios. Patio, patios. Zoo, zoos. Kangaroo, kangaroos. Tattoo, tattoos. Audio, Audios, cameo, cameos, cuckoo, cuckoos, ratio, ratios, stereo, stereos, video, videos, studio, studios. This is a good rule because we don't want three vowels in a row. We don't want O-O-E-S, I-O-E-S, do we? So we just add an S. Now number two, when a word ends in a consonant, plus O, we can add ES or S or both. There's no rule about this. But we always add S to the following words. Solos, pianos, banjos, egos, zeros. Now some dictionaries also allow ES for zeros. Hmm, confusing, huh? We add S to some new words to English. New modern words like videos, stereos, radios. We add S to short forms, abbreviations like kilos, photos, logos, typos, memos and prose. We add S to proper nouns like Eskimos. We also add S to words from other languages. Tacos, sombreros, solos, concertos, stilettos and sopranos. Let's look at adding ES. So number three, we add ES to the following words that came into English centuries ago. Tomato, tomatoes. Potato, potatoes. Hero, heroes. Those are three very common words. Mosquito, mosquitoes. Veto, vetoes. Echoes, dominoes, torpedoes, embargoes. Now number four. We have some words ending in O that can be spelled with either S or ES. Cargo, cargoes, mango, mangoes, motto, mottos, mementos, banjos, volcanoes, buffaloes, tornadoes, flamingos, frescoes, ghettos, halos, and that zeros again. As I said, some dictionaries allow the ES. Well, that's it. That's a, just a quick look at adding S or ES to words ending in O. 
and thank you very much for watching and I hope you've learned something. Why don't you go to my website www.howtospell.co.uk and go to the games bit in the menu and do a quiz on these. And also sign up for free spelling lessons straight to your inbox. Okay then, cheers for watching and listening and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.